In more detail, looking at the 3D cutaway, we also can create custom cuts. It doesn't need to be a straight line. If we're dealing with a very complex model, or if we're trying to view different parts of the model, the line that we cut doesn't need to be straight. This also just, if it is a very simple building shape or model shape, this does make a presentation look more interesting as well. So we can see that we've got a jagged edge, and this jagged edge was just created by creating a jagged marquee. So here you can see I went into a bit of detail to deliberately cut around the outside of the cars and then cut through the door openings, cut around some of the furniture and then through some of the furniture. So just by jagging in and out, creating a jagged edge, a sawtooth edge, whatever you want to call it, uh, it's creating that model, go back into 3D, Ah, what did I do wrong? I said show all in 3D. What I needed to do was right click, show selection, marquee in 3D. And if we just view this from above, we can see that what all I've done is I've used a unique shape to cut this away. Now, viewing this from above, viewing this from the side doesn't really make as much sense. Viewing this as a perspective and trying to get as close in as possible so we can sort of be inside every orientation so we're seeing the ceiling and we're seeing the floor is a really nice way of viewing this. It creates a, an interesting look. Uh, so that's what I'd recommend to create your interesting presentation.